Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Today we're looking at Taurus's new TX22 competition model. Check that out. Very different, very innovative. We're going to talk about that, but let's take a look at the TX22. Approximately two years to the date, 2019, right in February, Taurus released the TX22 and it reviewed so well. I got my hands on one. I loved it. I said, this is Taurus's new Rockstar. It has a great feel to it. A polymer frame, aluminum slide. It ran all types of ammo. I ran a bunch of different types of ammo through it. It's a striker fired handgun that has mags that carry 16 rounds and a four pound trigger. And I loved it. And many people did. It had an MSRP of 350 still does and people were picking it up for right around 300 bucks flash forward two years to today And now they have the competition model. They expanded they kept the primary features the same Which include the trigger all right? I'm measuring this one right at four pounds. Okay consistent with the other one same polymer frame check out that grip real nice feel to it and I already mentioned the 16 round magazines does have a pick rail right there and let's take a look at that trigger right now it's a single action striker fire 22 handgun which is unique in and of itself but it has a nice positive break and a short reset right there it also has a skeletonized aluminum slide and it, it's it's actually quite lightweight now this is a full-size model it has a five inch bull barrel which is different that is threaded in case you want to run a can adjustable rear sights and a pinned in front dot we're going to talk about that all right so let's let's take a look at the case because this is what is pretty interesting a lot of people wondering how much it is msrp 484 85 okay this is what the case looks like they're offering three 16 round magazines, but this is what I want to show you. This is a plate that goes right there. Okay, and then you can see that plate right there. I added it because I have a Vortex Venom. Now, between that plate and this plate, it will fit up to nine red dots. The most popular red dots will fit on the TX-22 competition. And I had no problem putting that little plate right here, okay, it works on both sides, okay, depending on what dot you have, but I, I had no problem mounting this uh, Vortex Venom on the TX-22 competition. So that's what I wanted to show you. It's a very unique design. Underneath, it has a sort of like a bunch of holes that that will work with various optics extremely innovative i love the way they did that but what also is unique is that some people will say this is a slide cut it's not a slide cut okay this adapter the adapter plates and the mounting plate is installed on the hood of the barrel which is very unique i'm going to show that when i disassemble it all right but it also has the front serrations and uh, ambi thumb safety right there all right and sweep it down good for lefties as well and it is very nice with that five inch barrel i found this to be extremely accurate with the original tx22 and i think this one is going to be even more so with that long barrel the vortex venom is a great red dot I, I i'm a huge fan of vortex and this is one touch on one touch off you can keep it on manual adjust it to yourself or you could set it so that it is auto dimming and brightening and that will automatically shut off after 14 hours so many options with the vortex venom real happy with that it even has those dots there to align with the rear sight great choice and i think combined this is pretty pretty special <laughs> i really believe so but i already mentioned it has a four pound single action trigger love it with a very short reset very nice polymer frame but let's take a look at that okay so the trigger is pulled you're going to pull back a little bit these takedown tabs you're just going to pull them down on both sides and then move the 
slide forward and off comes the slide from the frame you just you just move it a little bit and it comes right off now this is what I wanted to show you very unique okay so you have a captured recoil spring and guide rod steel guide rod and then this comes off the front or shall I say on top and that's what you're looking at it is really a unique design so that's mounted on the barrel hood okay not on the slide I've seen others said well it's the slides cut for a red dot no it's not the barrel hood is and so when you get this this piece right here is already assembled and then you choose the mounting plate for the red dot that that you went with all right so you put it on top and slide it through there and then you can see that it does have a cutout right there so you put this in place reinstall that do I have it yep and then to put it back together just put it in I don't know if I have that low enough there it is you get it just so it's like that just like that and pull it back in you're good to go check that out let's go ahead and get it on the scale this is you know everybody wants innovation they say give me innovation show me something innovative have you ever seen anything like that I haven't and I think it is pretty cool they took a, a phenomenal pistol that made, was made better one pound eight and a quarter ounces just ounces we're looking at 24 and an eighth ounce that's with the dot but I have a 16 round mag here all right and we'll go ahead and put the loaded weight on the scale 26 ounces even with 16 rounds you know you had another one that's a 22 what how much could it possibly weigh but I'm, I'm very much impressed with it I was impressed with the first one I actually sold that I sold that I was so upset and I said why did I do this one of those times where you, you actually sell something to a friend okay let's do a friend but I drove away and as I'm driving away I'm saying what did I just do but now they came out with the competition model and I'm happy to have this and I'm going to get to the range shortly shoot some 22 long rifle three mags of 16 rounds MSRP 484 85 we don't know what it's going to be at the stores yet but I do think they did a great job with this I'm very much impressed happy to have it in my hands and I cannot wait to show you more if you like videos like this please subscribe and share I always appreciate the thumbs up button thanks for watching and you guys be safe